And welcome into the ballpark. Happy to have you with us. The World Series on MLB The Show coming up. John Shabby and Chris Singleton with you. Plenty of storylines taking shape in this series as we set the stage for game four, Chris. Well, if the first three games are any indication, this has the look of a series that'll go all the way to game seven, Boog. I think this is a classic matchup, and we've seen momentum change course a few times already, but I'll tell you what, I think whoever takes this one will be feeling really good about their chances the rest of the way. Yeah, that's a good point. We've seen it before. Even when you're down 2-1, it seems like a win in game four can propel you to a series win more often than not. All right, we'll be back to get this one started after this. All right, ready to go here. And our pitcher in this game, Michael Marmolejo. What do we have on him? Well, he's a guy that needs to establish himself. Just settle in that first time through the order. Be able to command your first pitch. Base is empty. And now here is Mariano Castilla. Line drive. He's got it. And that is out number three. Middle of the first. Bottom half of inning number one coming up. No score after a half inning. And we're back here at Fenway Park. And today's starting pitcher, Matthew Legend. Try to stay back for that power changeup. Speed differential between the fastball and the changeup is huge. Hitters, they have a hard time staying back. And the righty deals. And down on strikes. And there's one down. Good pitch right there. I mean, he's attacking a location. That right hander kicks deals. The punch out there. And good work there as he gets a one, two, three. Out of the second from Fenway Park. No score. And a one two again. Hit on the ground might be two. Carew to second. Double play. And that'll do it for the inning. We go to the bottom of inning number two. We're tied. Nothing, nothing. Runner in scoring position now and a good opportunity to push across the first run of the ball game. Now it's going to be Brett Mason. Swing and a pop-up. Foul territory for the catcher. Puts the squeeze on it, and that is that. We'll move to the third with no score. Strike one. Line drive, caught! The pitch. Swings here and blasts one left field. Into the monster seats and gone! That one felt good, and that gives him a lead. It's 1-0. Just an excellent swing all the way around, and it had that sound coming off the bat that gets everyone's attention. Got a pitch to drive, short to the baseball, squared it up. And the pitch. Base hit. They get it in quickly. So first and second, now one out. Love how he let that ball travel, trusted his hands. Nice job of going the other way. Hit to the right side into the outfield is that the base runner at second has a very good reach. Oh, this ball's down, and that could bring in a run. Throw back in, holds the runner at third. Base is now loaded. Only one away. Four hits in a row, and they're really swinging it here. You see a ball come off the bat like that, you know it was pretty much a perfect... The pitch. Hit one run is in. Runner at third puts on the brakes, 
Bases still loaded and still only one away. Well, there you go. The RBI machine, another clutch run scoring it back. Yeah, he's been so good in these situations. Call it clutch if you want, but his resume speaks for itself. And here is Rich Pinto. Fly to right his first time. And that one handled. Slings to second. And they bounce into two already. This one ends the third. We move on to the bottom of inning number three. The Royals out front, two to nothing. Got some runs across. This is where you look for the starter to go out there, have a shutdown inning. This one swung on and hit well. Way back there. On the warning track. And hauls it in. Well, I think the wind ended up being a factor right there. It's ripping in from right field right now. So otherwise, I think. Right into the plate. And that's ball four. Ball four. What a battle. It's not always easy laying off a 3-2 pitch. Sure. Swing and a line drive. Base hit out of the center field. Just kind of sliced that one into center. Now, no waiting around right there. He was ready to swing it on the first pitch. That's about as textbook as it gets. Got his stride and load out of the way early. He stayed inside that one. Righty delivers. Oh, now this one's high and deep. Way back there. On its way. Gone. This place is absolutely limited. Just like that, they have been run. It's 3-2. He got on play with that high fastball, but look how his bat stays in the zone for a long time. Absolutely crushed that play. First and second. This to third. They get the force. That ends the frame. But the big blow of the inning comes right here. A three-run homer. It's now a three-two ball game. Just how quickly things could change. On the ground, two ball. Over to second for one. And they get him easily at first. It's a double play. That because I remember as an Oakland A's player, we were up in the series against. Oh, this one high and deep. Way back there. High bounce takes it over the fence. That's an automatic double. That was loud contact and a no doubt double off the bat. I didn't know it was going to land in the bullpen, though, and he's really improving his accuracy out there. It's almost like he tried to do it. Third baseman, Henry. The other way. That'll drop in as he plays it on a hop. The run comes in from second, and they lead by two. Oh, here we are, third time through the order, and this is where we see the OPS jump up. Manager might have to go to the bullpen a little bit sooner than he anticipated. Ciccone, the base runner at first with one out. Well struck left field. That's back there. And out of here, he deposits that one into the monster seats. A two-run shot, they tack on to their lead. It's 6-2. A good 
hitter gets pitch recognition early, he saw exactly where that was going to be. The challenge, not get over anxious and come out of your swing. He stayed on it and got all of it. You've got to figure out a way to shorten your path to the baseball. Put it in play somewhere. And a swing and a miss. And that'll do it. But they strike for three in the inning. Two on this two-run home run. It's now 6-2. Singleton and set to get us started. Bottom five, Eric Morey. Now a screamer into the outfield. He dives but can't hang on. That's a base hit. Throws to second, but he's in there easily. First pitch swing in, went up there with a the plan to be aggressive. As soon as that one shot off his barrel, he was thinking extra bases. Really nice job of getting the bat out front, but not hooking around it or rolling over it. Just kept the swing on plane and smoked that thing into the gap. Don't want to get beat inside, and as you see that pitch continue to run away from you, by the time it's in the catcher's mitt, you think it's a ball off the plate away. Slider squirts away. In there safely. Out to short. Zips it to first. Now two away as they get a run across. Boston all set for the top of the sixth. Now it's the right fielder, Ray Fernandez. That one the other way. Can't get there. Base hit. Makes the turn and heads for second. In safely, it's a double at his second hit. Drove that ball nicely, put a great swing on it, and it jumped off his back. Kind of put it all together there, and he's rewarded with the double. So, man aboard, next to hit, Mariano Castilla. A guy who makes an impact not just at the plate, but also in the field. Swing and a hard hit liner up the middle of the base hit. Runner comes in from second to score and they cut the lead. It's seven to three. Picks himself up at RBI. Fastball pretty much middle middle and that's what you fall asleep dreaming about as a hitter. So no surprise he put a great swing on it. On the ground. That's a hit. Throw back in quickly. First and second now with nobody out. Everything came together perfectly for him right there. Everyone's trying to elevate the ball in today's game, but if you can hit a ball that hard. That one ripped, and that should be extra bases. And it kicks off the base of the wall. One run is in. Yates headed for the plate. Cut off, now a throw home. In there, he scores. And now just a two-run deficit. Picks himself up a couple of ribbies. Loud contact, leads to the double. I mean, you could tell it had extra bases written all over it as it jumped off of his stick. And that... Smoked on the ground a second. And it gets by him. He's in safely at second. And a run comes in to score. We know you've got to watch the ball all the way into the glove. I think he just tried to be too quick right there and skip the first step of the process. I'm sure he's in disbelief at what just happened, more so than anyone else. Two. And now the lefty. Laser. Base hit. Ford. Rounds third. Headed for the plate. Play at the plate. And they cut him down. <laughs> Here 
barrel on, drive it into a gap, and score that run from first base. Up the middle. They take the force out. That's out number three. On to the bottom of inning number six. The Nationals leading this one seven to six. Count. I think you got to choke up a little bit, spread out the feet. You don't know what the velocity or the location of this next pitch is going to be. On the ground is short, and that's a base hit. They fired in quickly, so it's first and second with only one away. Love how he let that ball travel, trusted his hands. Nice job of going the other way. A little slider action. The pitch. Line drive, base hit. Throw comes in quickly, and the tying run forced to hold on at third with one away. That's back-to-back -back singles for him. Not a bad slider by any means. It was down and away, but an even better job to spoil that thing. And he let it travel, didn't try to hook it. Man, that's a really good approach. Tying runs now, just I'm home with the baseball instead of going to first base. Kicks and deals. Hit on the ground to the right side. Base hit, one run is in. The tying run is in to score, and we are starting over. All square at seven. That's three singles in a row. Not much to this one other than just a willingness to go the other way and put the ball in play. That's a team at bat right there. Nice job of staying back and letting the ball get deep. Now a huge at bat in this game coming up. Righty delivers. On the ground a second, might be two. There's one, and that's quick work out of the pen. One batter, two outs, inning over. So one run in the inning on this base hit, and we're deadlocked here at 7-7. Two down, nobody on. Here's a high chopper. In plenty of time to first. That is the inning. The go-ahead run aboard at first. Nobody out. Cut on and missed. Struck him out. And one out now. He came out of his mechanics there. Typically he likes to shoot. Now the left fielder, Willie Jimenez. And that one is lifted in the air. Matsui moving to his left. Makes the grab on the run. And that ends the inning. The old one. Here's the pitch. Run around the goal. In the dirt. The throw. Tag. And he's out. Well, you can get away a little bit with not being so accurate when you've got such a great arm and you get rid of it quickly. And that's what happened right there. He made up for the lack of accuracy with excellent velocity. Nice job with the catch and throw right there. Liner to second and picked on the hop to first. And that's the third out. It's the ninth, and we are tied. To the right side, Carew handles, gathers, and throws to first. And that is that. A 9 1 2 scheduled to lead off the bottom of the ninth. And we are tied 7 7. Two now. Swing and a miss. And he's down on strikes. And the inning is over. Line drive, pulls it down, and there's two gone. Throw not in time as he's able to get back to avoid the double play. Now, and here is Tino Salazar. 
Out to short. St. John collects it. Tosses the first. That's the third out. Ah, that hit him. And the leadoff man is aboard to start the inning. Well, that can happen when you... Winning run on base at first. No outs. Rudder goes again. Pitch misses inside. Throw to second. Great jump. And that is a stolen base. It wasn't even close. Well, with that kind of elite arm he has behind the plate, man, it's a pretty big deal when you can swipe a bag against this dude. Maybe more than anything, it prevents teams from just testing. Runner up to scoring position. Good job. Left-hand batter waits. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. One out. Oh, well, there he gets the slider in on his hands, and it just eats him off. You know, it's hard to get the bat around on a pitch like that in tight. You just feel like you're crowded on the inside part of the plate. Can't get any extension. That's what he definitely should have laid off of. And the right-hander deals. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. And he's down on strikes for the second time today. Well, this guy competes hard. We see the emotion there. I love it. Great job of getting out of the jam. That's ripped into the outfield. And it's off the wall. Well, a big swing of the bat right there. Nice line drive to the pull side, met it out front, but just stayed through it nice enough and ripped it into the outfield. One away, tie game. Go ahead, run stands at first. On the ground to third. Could be extra bases. Runner around third. The relay to the plate. He beats it safe. It's now 8-7. Well done. Drives in the run. Just one of those seen eye base hits through the infield. He just kind of rolled over on it a little bit, but sometimes those can find a hole and get you a knock. Runner takes off for third. Pitch in for a strike. And the throw, he's out at third. Well, I could see he had a big lead out there at second base, so it wasn't a shock when he took off. But trying to steal third right there, it's kind of risky, man. You're already in scoring position, so you've got to make sure that you can make it there safely. That wasn't the case. Left-hand hitter waits. That one hit to right. Mori under this one. Brings it in for the third out. But a run will score in the inning on this RBI double. And the home team down a run. Sui. The wind of the pitch. High in the air, out to right. Fernandez settles underneath it, and there's one down. The catcher number five. Mason. On the ground to the left. Perez handles the chance, gets it to first, and they're down to their last out. They believe that their stuff is better than that guy standing in the batter's box, what his swing, what his ability is. In the air, out to center, Castilla drifts towards it. Ball game. Well, all these guys need is one more win, but when you're playing in the postseason, it's not just a win of a game, it's a win of an inning. It's a win of it at bat, it's a win of a pitch count, and that's what they're going to need to do in the next game to take the series.
So it took extras, but here's how the numbers shake out from this one. Well, they couldn't settle this one in nine, but who doesn't love some extra inning baseball in the postseason? And a final, eight to seven. A one-run extra inning win for Chris Singleton and our entire crew. I'm John Chompy saying so long.